All right. No, oh, this point here, right? No. Hmm. Oh, I can play this intermediate move. Attack the bishop here. And then win this pawn on, on d5. There we go. Uh, this pawn on e4, though. And I'm so... Oh, right. You can take it that way. Hmm. Well, then. Um, don't care. I'm going to take this pawn. <laughs> I'm going to lose this g2 pawn. I am down pawn. I don't know where my center is. F. Three so ugly looking. Uh, G two rook there, rook G seven ideas maybe. Draw. <laughs> Ouch. Uh, well, we're trading pawns. Uh, I guess I'll take this. Okay. Well, I wasn't looking to castle anyways. So we'll play the end game here. Um, by first playing rook back here. And then king d2. Um, I don't think that was a good trade for black. I think my bishop was doing absolutely nothing um, yeah, compared to his so um, knight. So yeah, definitely didn't do anything with that. King d2, rook e8, knight there, knight c6, attacking his pawn. And we're looking for some queenside play. So definitely I don't think that that was the right idea, but I could be wrong. I could be wrong. So knight c6 is a good plan square. I'm going to play f3. Despite what they say, I should put my pieces on dark squares. f3 prevents bishop e4 so that he doesn't get the long square diagonal anymore. In addition, I'm trying to get my rooks on the queen side a little bit. Um, yeah, so... Um, I mean, I, I I know there's a pin coming up, but I can always play king e3. No, not yet. Um, um, I always have the spike check, but where does it lead to? Check, rook here, up. Um, oh, and then b6. b6 ideas. Um, the knight there, though. And b7. Oh, suck. Um, ah, rookie king e3, pawn push. Alright, knight e6. Let me try this. And there's no discovery that you could do. Um, but for safety measures, we'll just play this move here. So, if we trade on everything, I should try to win back a pawn. I'm trying to win back the a6 pawn right now. Um, but b6, b7 is my idea now. And if rook here to attack the pawn and fork. Uh, so this knight is pretty good. Bishop can't go to e4 even though he wants to. So this bishop was ill-placed. Um, so I can win it back the pawn now. That's good. Um, let's put this on a dark square. And then let's check c3 a little bit. I don't think you can win this. Okay. I'm going to win that pawn now, I think. I'm pretty sure I won that pawn. So I got my pawn back. Bishop is blocked. And um, I have this passed pawn on here, so, and he doesn't have bishop e4 ideas, um, just activating the bishop. So now I'm just down a minute and 22 seconds, and so, yeah, we're going to take this pawn here, thank you. Rook e3 spike check, and then king down. Um, I think. <laughs> and then here. I wrote text here, then I have b6, b7, and b8, I think. So. Mm. So I meant by like the f3 before. So. Do I play this first? Yeah. 
and then I'm covering most of the bright squares. End game here. Um, that can't be right. Oh, jeez. Fine. All right, so I'm just looking to win this pawn here and then make a pass pawn. So. Mm -mm. That's good. All right. Okay, so no draws. All right, so I'm trying to defend here. I'm pretty sure he's just trying to flag me. So, um, because this rook pawn ending should be a draw, should be. Uh, no, it should be a win for him. <laughs> Since I'm down pawn, um, right, let's oscillate this. Oh, jeez. Right. Never mind. No, it's bad. I thought I had the queen move, so GG. Uh, Hmm. All right, so we have chess kid there. <laughs> uh, all right, I was looking for that pass one. Did I have any advantage? Okay, I thought my plan was sound, like just taking this pawn back. Ah, uh, okay, so this might be the move that killed me, or... No, oh, King F4? Really? To prevent this? Oh my goodness. Hmm. I, I, see, I was talking about this Bishop E4 idea. Because this Bishop is terrible on D3 and on G6, so... Um, but yeah, chess kid, I'm, uh, Amazonoid, National Master. Um... So, I wasn't sure if this worked. The king g7, I mean, king g what? Uh, e5 check, king g4. I, I, I was thinking about preparing, like, maybe here I should play f4, f3, excuse me, but. Okay, so bishop e4, f3. Oh, why did I play there? Oh, geez, f3, oh my goodness. Uh, okay, so at least I'm coming up with the right plan. F3, bishop g6. If he takes, then I think I have a pass pawn that's winning. Um, because I'm short one move from promoting, so king here, look all the way, moves up. <sighs> oh well, alright, so we went from 2173 to 2073, so it dropped 100 points. So, alright. Um, then the opening wasn't that great either, I think. Yeah, definitely he had all the position. But this is, I thought this was bad. So yeah, he should have just taken this pawn and left. Ruined my pawn structure and then I should have resigned. Like if he did bishop takes g2, I would have resigned here. Um, but he did this, I was fine. I mean, this knight was more centralized. This bishop was doing nothing. So my pawn was to attack on a a7. Attack the rook game tempo. Um, no shenanigans with discovery. Maybe I should play f3. No, king e3, good. Uh, I could take the pawn right now, but I decided to prep it. Yeah, f3. Uh, f3, instead of f4, f3. So, alright. Let's go into the pool. I clicked the big 5 button, so I will be paired again.
F3, yeah. Hmm. Say chess. Hello. Um, C6, Karakon. Karakon advance. Now uh, to prevent B5. Um, right here. So now we're playing playing bishop back, or because we want to get this bishop out before we play e6 to protect this pawn. Um, so attack the tempo. E6, attacking b4. And so now I have ideas of like maybe just push this pawn. Yeah, push his pawn. And so this is like a big thorn in his position, I think, um, after this takes. Um, C3 is not possible, maybe. Um, I can play even, uh-oh, lag, 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 OK. I can even play knight there. Let's just castle first, and then we can play knight b4. And the idea is, you know, play on the C flower a bit. All right, so let's uh, rook c8. Um, oh, this square, right. Um, let's play bishop back to e7 and play something towards, oh, this square too. Hmm. <laughs> We're looking at squares now. All right, so we need to get this uh, queen side play going. Should I take this knight here, but then he develops? I say this. Yeah, let's play knight uh, b5 here. Knight b4 next move. Um, so if we trade out in knight b4, this pawn is maybe going to go down. All right, take this. Knight b4. Nope. Nope, not yet. Um, g6 to attack the knight. Take this. Um, here. So it takes, takes, bishop takes, bishop block, and at least I have my rooks more active, I guess. I think I'm going to, I'm going to lose that pawn for sure, but hopefully I can get the c2 pawn, b2 pawn, and then um, hopefully with, with that I can probably try to get these weak side pawns, because these pawns... If the pieces are off the board, these are this this put king safety is a little bit weaker than mine, so maybe I can win some pawns there. Um, so that's the plan. That's the plan I have. So here we go. Uh, rook d8. If he does, if he doesn't do anything to protect this pawn, uh, rook d8 sounds good. Bishop takes this knight. Rook takes probably. Uh, knight takes, ooh, knight takes, eek. Mm. Queen takes? No. Takes, what do you takes here? What if he does? Takes here, rook takes, knight takes, rook back. No, blah, no, discovery check. No, 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 no. Queen takes, I see two there, and then queen to... A4, B4, E4, E4, attacking that. Okay, so he's doing that version. So this is the version that didn't... And I'm okay with this one. Because I do this, takes this, takes then this. Um, B6 and then Knight F5. G, F5, then... Well, no, you're hanging the bishop right now. So you have to answer the bishop. So I can do Rook. No, queen takes and then rook takes, discovery maybe? Queen d4, move this king away. And now rook d8, and now I have basically all the center with my rooks. And I'm ready to just coming down with queen b4, attacking the 